All right, so I have to admit that Command Conquer Generals definitely grew on me, especially the last two missions that we played as the Chinese. So we're gonna be going ahead and finishing off the whole game, which will include the campaign as the Global Liberation Army and as the USA. I have to say that it is pretty relevant playing as the Global Liberation Army, especially now with ISIS in the Middle East. It seems like they definitely have the same goals as the GLA in Command Conquer Generals. So it's gonna be pretty interesting to see how the campaign goes. We're going to go ahead and get cracking. We'll be playing on normal difficulty, just so we don't get too crazy. And uh, we rip our hair out from dying all the time. But we should be good, though. One thing I hate about this game is that there's not much cutscenes or anything. Except the council of your compatriot, Kenwar Khan. We have lost many soldiers in our struggle with the Eastern Dragon. But as a result, our enemy has spread its defenses too thin. They have left important economic and civilian targets unguarded. This should be our next objective in our war against the global oppressors. Let us rise again, my brother. You can lead us to our final victory. All right, the guy was still talking to you in the loading screen. Oh, after the loading screen. Our cause is just, and our soldiers stand ready. We shall fall upon our foes like lightning from a cloudless sky. Oh boy, there's going to be quite a bit of destruction in this campaign, I'd imagine. We're going to be rather ruthless as well with the amount of uh, guys that we end up killing. So it seems like the Chinese are our enemy in this mission. I'm assuming that it's both the Chinese and um, the US that are going to be the enemies during the campaign. Uh, let's go ahead and uh, destroy their tank first. There we go. Got our own tanks. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, I'm tempted to just send like this truck in just to. Ex oh, here we go. There's a Actually, I don't need, even need to send him in to explode himself. All right. What I think I should do is just hotkey these guys and send them away, just so they don't cause too much mayhem around our guys. Let's get around to destroying this space, and hopefully we'll be able to create our own one. Be able to build buildings out of sand and dust. Move to our mountain hideout and prepare for counter-attack. The Chinese are scouring the hills for our hidden base. General, the Chinese are dug in around that hydroelectric dam. Destroying the dam will free the villagers from Chinese tyranny. The Chinese have laid claim to this peaceful village and are spreading their vile propaganda among these simple fishermen. We have rumors of a secret arms dealer operating in this area. If we can find him, we can buy weapons for our cause. General, our goal is clear. Destroy the dam. Make the Chinese pay for their arrogance. Loaded and ready. Alright, so it's like we're going to end up going back up. Um, although... Okay, alright, so where we were before seems to have disappeared on the map. Alright, so let's have a look at what we can get. We can get a worker who builds buildings, okay. Uh, we can also have rebels and RPG troopers and another worker. Oh, okay. You think, isn't this the same building though? What building is this? The su ah, supply stash, okay. And they collect supplies. Ah, I see how it works. All right, we already have a couple of them here. Um, maybe we'll be able to build something else. So we already have the barracks. All right, we're going to get used to all these buildings now. A tunnel network, base defense, an underground tunnel. Right, that's pretty cool. Um, or an arms dealer. All right, so we don't have an arms dealer just yet. The Chinese are close. Give them a surprise. Unless there are some buildings around here. Hopefully they come around the south way. Because we don't really have that defended very well at all. So I uh, like how uh, actually relevant this mission really is, or just this whole storyline, because ISIS managed to capture the Mosul Dam, and uh, there were fears that they were going to destroy it, which seems like that's what we're going to be doing here. So <laughs> it's amazing how um, Command and Conquer actually managed to tell like the future of warfare, with especially like in the normal Command and Conquer series with 
the terrorists and everything, the terrorist network, pretty much ruling the West as enemies. Um, what are these guys doing? These guys seem to be just patrolling the area. Um, all right, we can also get the technical, which is a just a pretty basic truck. All right, pretty much what you'd expect in the Middle East. Oh, we can get a scorpion tank. All right, or a radar van. Can spot hidden enemy units. Okay. Don't think we'll really be needing that. These guys are definitely going in a patrol, so that's all good. Our way is through. We will not be hindered. Okay. Uh, now this guy, he can't really get anything, can he? Like maybe we could build a tunnel network. Uh, it's a bit meh. We'll just hang back. We'll get this guy to collect the resources, and there's a heck of a lot of them. Oh, right, that's where this guy is, so... Unfortunately, we can't repair our vehicles, but we'll get... You know what, we'll get this guy as well. Get two of them for good measure. Now, I wouldn't be surprised if I'd just be able to send in this army and just send them in over here to destroy the dam. But... We'll wait it out. I have many weapons for sale. Perhaps some home-built rockets for your tanks. Oh. Scorpion rockets. That seems very nice. Got the Euro, tr Euro Truck Simulator going on. All right. Speaking of Euro Truck Simulator, I think American Truck Simulator is coming out very soon as well. Going. Gonna have to check that out. All right. So let's go ahead and explore what's happening over here on the eastern side, though. Hang on. Here we go. We'll take him apart. Oh. Good idea. We'll break him down. We'll break oh, him oh, down. Oh, oh, oh. That's not good at all. Installed, sir. We'll take him apart. I definitely don't want to get in the way of all those tanks. That's not a good look. Alright. So I think it might be the best for us to attack him from up top. What I'll do though, is I'll just send one of these guys in up here. Just to explore. Oh. Oh, he's spotted. Oh, really? It's got quite the view. Alright, so let's go with some uh, scorpion tanks then. Just spam them out. Alright. He's obviously keen to fight us, that's alright. Alright, we can get some emergency re emergency repairs going on as well. Alright. This is definitely going to be more than enough to destroy everything in the way, but we're going to have a bit more fun. Oh, alright, these scorpion attacks, I definitely remember they were causing us a bit of uh, pain with their missiles. What's that? Is that a bit of cash? Okay, guess a bit of debris. I'm not going to use the repair thing just yet. I'll send all these suicide vehicles away. Oh, we can actually disguise it. Oh, that's cool. No lack of courage. Okay. What? Yes, I know. So I've cleared the road out. Wouldn't be surprised if uh, at the end of the mission we have to actually destroy... Oh, wow, there's a heck of a lot of cash over here. If we have to destroy all the units around. Um, can this, uh, these tanks actually start shooting? That'd be damn great. Here we go. The rocket grenades can actually do a lot more. And then just these little buggies. Should be a lot of money here though. It's like 500 or so each. It's quite a bit. Alright. Now I'm assuming... I'm not quite sure which way we'd be able to go. Let's go around this way. You can always explore a little bit more. No such thing as too much exploration, I guess. Alright, that's where the um, previous base was. Okay. I was going to say, how come we don't see that on the map? You guys come down here. I think we're definitely going to have to come down over here, though, whether we like it or not. Oh. Definitely send all these guys in. Hopefully there's not going to be troops coming out of here. Doesn't seem like there is, so it's good. Alright, um, let's also go destroy this. Had enough of the Chinese communist propaganda. And off goes the fisherman's village. 
Run. All right, terrorists definitely love us. That's for certain. Um, all right, so that's the fishing village there. Not really all that fussed over that. These guys are taking their cargo, which is all good. It's like mincemeat out of those humans, though. We are going. Good idea. I think I might need a couple more guys. Um, Alright, they're not coming into attack, so that's good. Oh, wow. Okay. I was going to say, maybe we should get a couple more vehicles and all. Which we do have enough money for, so. And I set up a waypoint right over here. Just waiting for these other tanks to come in. <laughs> it's going to be more than enough for us, though. If only you can speed this up. Uh, maybe we could heal someone up. There you go. That doesn't do too much. Uh, I guess it does the job. Alright, let's go. Attack him right where it hurts. Yeah, hopefully these bunkers don't have too many people, because that could hurt us. I think we'll be all good though. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, we've got way more than enough. To destroy everything. Ooh, level 3. These um, vehicles definitely do... Quite a bit of damage here around as well. Can't complain. All right. Now there's only like two or three more buildings left. Including a propaganda tower. Right, where are these guys? Oh, they're already here. Very nice. Oh, let's have more vehicles around. And that dam is... How do you get there? That's a great question. Unless it's all on the other side that we need to get through. Which wouldn't surprise me either. We'll just go ahead and... Uh, here we go. That works. Let's see how they get there. Alright, oh, it's this way. That way was completely hidden to me before. I didn't see that. This is definitely a secret way, that's for certain. I mean, you don't have a um, rocket. You should have a rocket on you. Anyways. Won't be surprised if you find some more people around here. Maybe. No, maybe they were right. It's uh, definitely not very well guarded. Oh, what are you guys doing? Absolutely nothing. That's what they're doing. They're we'll we'll sending in some um, chemicals or something in those bullets. All right. We'll you know, all these guys, just send them up over, all over here so we can pack quite the punch. This dam definitely is not going to stand a chance, and I guess the rest of the Chinese are going to fall very shortly. Hopefully, at least. Oh, it actually didn't even destroy all of it. Um, what's going to happen to our city, though? Behold, doom has come to our enemies. Like a tide, we shall sweep over them and drown them in their own greed and evil. Right, we didn't even care about our own people. Not quite sure if we can be celebrating that. Oh, what now? Oh, right. <laughs> I was going to say. I guess uh, there was a propaganda tower and all there, but definitely there wasn't too much. They created two units as well. Interesting. All right. We also destroyed a heck of a lot of their units. Not all of them, but most of them at least. Anyway, next mission.